Hello everyone, my name is Perry Weisberg. I'm here to tell you a little bit about the all-new 3820 Paralink Coulter Drill. The Borgo 3820 Paralink Coulter Drill represents an exciting new concept in air coulter drill technology. The 3820 is equipped with the all-new PLR or Paralink Roll Opener designed from the ground up to give you exceptional seed placement accuracy when configured to seed either volumetrically or with the all-new Borgo air planter option. Built on the same robust frame design as the 3720 Paralink Coulter Drill, the 3820 PCD is available in widths ranging from 30 feet to 70 feet and row spacing options of 7.5 inch, 10 inch and 12 inch Row crop options are also available to quickly set up for 15 inch, 20 inch, or 24 inches concurrently for row crops. And the PLR opener is the first to allow application of granular phosphate with the seed in a planting configuration. Equipped with the Borgo Midrow banders, the 3820 delivers exceptional fertilizer placement options giving you the greatest yield potential in all conditions. Curtis will now tell you more on the PLR opener design. Okay, I wanted to take a little bit of time today to talk about our new PLR opener, which you'll find on the 3820 single disc Coulter drill. And this opener was designed in conjunction with our air planter feature that we're offering in 2021. So let's start off at the top end here. First thing I want to point out is we use a full parallel linkage for this PLR opener. And the reason we do is we always want that attack angle to be consistent in the full range of the opener up and down. So that's a big advantage over competitors in the marketplace that don't use a parallel linkage. So the next component I want to talk about is the uh, heart of the opener, of course, which is your coulter. We use a compound Coulter angle and by compound what I mean by that is we use a 7 degree lateral angle as well as a 10 degree vertical angle. Why we do that is we want to give the opener the ability to stay in the ground in hard conditions or to penetrate the ground in hard conditions but we also want it to do a good job to prevent hairpinning. While we're down here let's start looking at the scraper seed boot combination that's on this unit. So if you take a look at the front scraper delivery boot, it's multi-purpose this tool. So this not only keeps the coulter clean during use in varying conditions, but it also delivers whether it be granular fertilizer when in, used in conjunction with the planter boot, or if you're using this opener volumetrically for fertilizer and seed. Let's talk about the planter seed boot right here. So if you have your PLR opener set up for planting, the XP meter delivers the seed under pressure directly at the pinch point between the firming wheel and the ground, keeping your seed spacing accurate from your meter and at the same time pressing that seed into the furl. There's an adjustment on your seed boot scraper combination here vertically. We also have vertical adjustment on the firming wheel itself done by this bolt here and as well the planter seed tube or seed boot is also adjustable so you can make all the adjustments needed to keep that good precise placement of your seed and keep that firming wheel in the right position. The firming wheel itself is also on a rubber mounted system so that it can flex and follow over any contours it needs to. Okay, we've made the adjustment for seed depth very, very simple. It's done with this adjustment handle here, which follows through to a shaft to the other side on the gauge wheel, cleaner wheel on the other side of the coulter assembly. Your seed depth adjustment is very easy in quarter inch increments, adjustable one notch at a time. Very easy to do, very easy to change that depth. So we do have two packer wheels that uh, we offer on the PLR opener. The one that's currently mounted on this PLR is the offset packer wheel. This is the packer wheel we would suggest you use in 
minimum till or pre-worked soil conditions to achieve the best pack and the best furrow closure in those types of conditions. In a no-till application, we recommend this V-style packer. So it gives you that better soil to seed contact in a no-till situation, more pressure over the seed if you require it. They are adjustable with where they sit laterally to the seed opener, simply by these adjustment washers here. We also have the ability to change the angle of that packer wheel in either case. Where you might find that necessary is in certain soil conditions where you're trying to close that furrow and get a good pack job. Maybe in that heavier, wetter ground, clay soils, that type of thing. The final component of the PLR opener is our gauge wheel. And this is really a multi-purpose tool for this opener. It does really three tasks. It keeps your disc clean. It is a containment device for the soil as you're moving along at high speeds. Its main purpose, I guess you'd say, would be to control your seed depth. So you can see when I'm adjusting the single point seed depth, that adjusts the gauge wheel position. So we offer two gauge wheel options for the PLR opener, the narrow and the wide gauge wheel. We recommend the narrow gauge wheel to be used in direct seeding, minimum tillage, zero tillage. But when you get into that more tillage applications where you're doing a lot more tillage prior to seeding, we do recommend this wider gauge wheel holds up that opener in that looser soil situation. Thanks everyone for watching our presentation on the 3820 Paralink Culture Drill. Pricing is out on these new multi-purpose drills, so you can call your dealer to find out more on how they will benefit your bottom line. Or better yet, come and see us to have a look at the unit for yourself. The head office in St. Brew is a great place to see all of our equipment, but we also have a complete setup here in Minot and would be happy to walk around the 3820 Paralink Culture Drill with you, as well as the air planter option. You can also have one of our dealers in your area give you more information on this exciting new product. Have a great summer. Thank you.